Welcome back to Celery Man. Oh, sorry, I'll scoot. Um, can you generate a nude Leon? Not computing. Welcome. Nude Leon. This is not suitable for Ashley. Are you sure? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh sh! What the? Like, what does he say that requires two beeps? I don't know. <laughs> does he say like "oh shit, fuck"? Hey, I got two first aid sprays. Need oh. Oh yeah, put it on movie, cause for a more cinematic experience. No, I have movie set to fix uh, to fix uh, Super Nintendo games. Oh. Cause their palette is messed up for some reason when connected to this TV. Because your cathode ray tubes are all janked. Don't fuck. You've already done it. Talk you've already, shit you've already about done that. my cathode ray tubes. You've already gone back tubes. there. Piece of shit. I knew. I was just making sure. Because I'm pretty yeah, sure yeah, we have to do that section again that we failed. Unless you did it. But I don't you think... did it. I did it. He did it. But I don't think you did. Football? Did you say football? Oh, wait. We haven't done this. Nope. We tried to do it, but... I feel like you need to put Ashley in a spot where... She's not going to get hit by fireballs, but it's also going to take them a while when they grab her. Wait. I don't know why I shook the Wiimote when the cutscene happened. See, right here, I can already... Go get the spinel. Hey, don't tell me what to do. You would have forgot it. I actually, I probably would have. There's gonna be a point where I don't remember things as well, so I'm gonna uh, I'll stop backseat gaming. Well, don't worry. I know the name of the machine gun guy. I remembered him while I was sleeping yesterday. His name is JJ. The fuck are you talking about? The, the he they're like near the end parts of the game on the island. There are these guys with machine guns. Oh, the big dudes? And they are JJ. Uh -oh. See, I want... See, I was, I was going to tell you. Well, I know how to do it! But I didn't. I was... I'm trying to... I'm trying to restrain myself. No! Okay, uh -oh. go get her. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. No. Uh... You you got enough time to get down there. <laughs> just shot him in the chest. You were, <laughs> you just got shot in your chest. You were popping that you were popping off that good shit and just said fuck shit a second ago, but then you got kicked in your chest. I don't think I'm gonna get her. Dude, they walk really slow. Oh my god, just take her. Whatever. I'm tired of hearing her. Go suplex that motherfucker. Suplex him right in front of her. Suplex him onto her. Make them one. Make her follow. I was going to. Because I think... Well, let me finish my sentence. I think that you're not suplexing them, and that's really pissing me off. What well, if time I shoot him in the knee? <laughs> they fall over. I want to see their head smash, BJ. Okay, I'm going to avoid suplex. Yeah! Yeah! Did you see that, Ashley? <laughs> no. She had her head ducked. Cute girl is watching, so it's cool to do it. Are these guys not going to turn into a Plagas not until yet. later? Not yet. Oh wait, there's like different. There's like a different type of Plagas thing that ends up happening. I'm pretty sure it doesn't have the uh, the swingy part that goes. Yeah, I, I'm trying to. I don't remember what it does, but it does I know, something. And I know it is different. <clears throat> you ever notice how? When we're playing RE4, we typically just talk about RE4, but when we're playing Metroid Prime, we talk about other things, because you can't focus on the game <laughs> that we're currently playing. I mean... 
Metroid is a... It, it's, I will admit there's not as much to talk about. I mean, the, but, that's exactly it. It's just like with Me with Resident Evil, there's like a, a lot of things happening. But with Metroid, there's a lot of things happening. I mean, mostly I can just talk about what I'm currently doing in Metroid. With this, we can talk about suplexing people and shit. It's like, oh, cool. You, you can leave her in that room, I believe. And she'll be safe. Okay, I guess I'll take your word Wait. for it. I mean, people can go in there and get her, but she's going to be safe from the explosions. I didn't get this one. But there's nobody on it. Doesn't look like. <laughs> that was a headshot. Okay, I see where he is now. Uh-oh. <laughs> I think you might be able to get away from it. Oh, I did get away from it. I don't know. I couldn't get to the barrel. Stop! I don't know where the barrel is. Just shoot the dude on there. Maybe I can get him from here? No. Yeah, how do you like this? You can't see as well. Up close. Your targeting systems have been compromised. Man, these glasses make it weird to lay down like I'm used to. I think you got him? It's like most of the time I don't notice that I'm wearing them until I want to do something that I, like, used to not be able... Like, I can't lay on my side anymore with the glasses on. Fucking glasses. I'm glad I don't need glasses. I would hate having to, like, having to wear something on my face all the time. Yeah, I really don't notice them most of the time. I until mean, I guess I can imagine after a while, but... I mean, I've only had them for, like, two days, and oh. I don't even notice. It's still, like, a piece of you attached to you, and you gotta be conscious of it with certain tasks. Yeah. Sometimes you gotta adjust them. I mean, it's just like having long hair. It's exactly like having long hair. It's I'd hate to have long hair and glasses. Man, that would be... Because I imagine my hair might get stuck in the hinges of the glasses and pull. It's not that bad. I mean, I can just... just Here, have some hair. Ah! Ah! <laughs> you just pulled out like 15 hairs! <laughs> it doesn't hurt that much. It actually hurts more if it's just like one or two hairs. But since there's a bunch of different hair follicles sharing the load, it's not as bad. How'd you get in here? Welcome. We just saw you outside. He's he's got like servant um hey, passages. List of what are you buying? Oh boy. Are you gonna upgrade that rot gun? Thank you. There's a better shotgun later on. Come back anytime. You're right. I shouldn't have done that. But I did it in a while. Oh man, here we go. Here we go. It's not Han again. Oh wait, it is. Leon, where's your? <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Yes, I'll take the platinum sword. It looks like Dante's sword. <gasps> uh oh uh, uh. It was a future for Platinum Games, even though he was still with uh, Capcom at the time that Devil May Cry came out. And then he made Clover Studios, and Clover Studios failed because they didn't make enough money, so he went to Plat. He made Platinum Studios, which again, and uh, they don't make a lot of money, but I guess they make more money now. It's to me, it's it's weird that people keep hiring Platinum Games. Like, I love Platinum Games. Like, they're great games, but... They don't sell. At all. I think the Wonderful 101, like, only sold in, like, the hundred thousands. Really? Like, it, I know it never got anywhere close to a million. Um, but... Like... Yep, that, that is it. He's got like a big old centipede. 
Big old. Big old. Yep. And like, I, I, I imagine Bayonetta 2 did a lot better than um, Wonderful 101. But still, damn. Didn't do that well. Metal Gear Rising is probably their best game that they've sold. Maybe. I imagine Scalebound is gonna sell like shit. Scalebound? That's his Xbox One exclusive game that he's making. I've heard the name, and that's it. Uh, you've seen the trailer. They showed it at E3. Maybe I didn't watch that part of E3! I mean, it was Microsoft, so... Hopefully it'll be on PC and they'll, like, make it with, like, Windows 10 or something, I don't know. I need to update to Windows 8.1 so I can upgrade to Windows 10 for free. Yeah. Last time I updated to Windows 8.1, my whole computer fucked up, though. Yeah, so. well, maybe that was your fault. Probably. You asked for it. Now you put the platinum sword in there. Thank you! Josh? And you keep the golden sword to sell. Do you? No. That was a test. You're bad at video games. I mean... This is about as far as I got when I was playing the PC version not too long ago. I got farther than you, motherfucker. Yeah, well, I beat it like several times before that. Oh, God, I'm hungry. Why are you killing this Kratos? I'm hungry. Ohangi. I don't need your stupid dinner. I've got Ohangi. This is going to be weird because... We're talking about this right now, but this is going to be going up before the episode of Metroid Prime where we were just talking about Ohundi. Yeah, it's like kind of, it's like Pulp Fiction, honestly. It's all out of order. Has anybody put together that in order to watch? Actually, yes, they have. I never watched it. It, it starts out with uh, the scene with Christopher Walken uh, showing... The ring. The uh, the pocket watch. Oh yeah, pocket watch. To Bruce Willis's character as a kid. Quentin Tarantino's weird. And then I guess it ends with. Uh, What's her name dying? Does it? I I don't know what the ending would be. I can't remember. I haven't watched it in a couple of years. What? Oh, shit. I must have dropped it when I was running away from them. Dropped what? A drug that'll stop your convulsions. Look, I know you're carriers. You've been coughing up blood, right? Yeah. And you? Yes. Damn it. The eggs have hatched. <laughs> I don't want to watch that. But yeah, they they they're 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 carrying. There's a dude right behind that door. This door? Yeah. To your right. No, you let them come out and just shoot them. That's a bad idea. What you're doing? <laughs> I thought I could time it better. Excuse me, sir. There's a crossbow dude up there, too. There's shield guys that come out over there as well. Oh, it seems that you, you're trying to kidnap my girl. Would you like help with that? Damn it. Hey Ashley, is this loud? Do you have permanent hearing damage yet? No, she's covering her ears, see? That that doesn't I, I don't know if that'll help if you're like she's <laughs> down the barrel from it. I love those jokes that they constantly do in Archer that like action movies and shows ignore of, of firing uh, guns in closed quarters. Oh yeah. And Archer just always complains. He's like, thanks! 
like my tinnitus couldn't get any worse. Mop, mop, mop. And then he starts doing that for some reason. It opens up your ears. Mop, mop, like loud, like ah, uh, noises like that. Like doing that with your throat will open up your ears. I didn't know that. I'm just talking out my ass, right? <laughs> really? Yeah. I don't know if that's the case. Well, I mean, yawning does. Yeah. And saying that is kind of close to it. I had to yawn after you say that, you bastard. <laughs> yeah, that crossbow guy. <laughs> it took him a minute. I shot him he's, once. He's like reflecting on his life choices while he's down there. He's just deciding, like, man, I am... Should I even get up? Oh, let's take these off right now. You don't need glasses. It's a little bit blurrier without them. Minuscule. How are you... Like, I can close one eye and then unfocus that eye. How does that work? I thought it took two eyes to, like, make that a difference. That makes science a myth. Jesus confirmed. I didn't say that. I said science wasn't real. If science isn't real, Jesus isn't real. Because you know what? What if Jesus was just a scientist? Exactly. Well, he was a carpenter. That's which is, science. Which was like the scientist of the of like the 1800s. <laughs> <laughs> hey, there it is. But now you're gonna now you're gonna die. Because once you take the get that, everybody spawns. Look at all the suplexes! I I wish I, I should have headshotted him though. Oh, gross! Did you see that? Uh. Look at their heads! Oh yeah, they 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 go back. I really don't understand why people diss the TMP now. Like after seeing you use it, I'm just like. Whoa. Why is everybody so mad about that gun? Because they're shitters. Seems like a super fucking useful gun. It is. Very. Verily. I like I like video games. Video yeah, I guess. Just kidding, they're awful. Yeah. yeah. I was <laughs> I was I was I was leading you on with that just to make sure. Oh baby! Broken butterfly. Reload that. You can't reload it until it's empty, or no, I don't have any ammo. That's what. I'm mad. How does that revolver have eight bullets? Hold on. That is not how revolvers work. Well, you can have an eight-cylinder revolver. Is it? One, two, three, four, five, six. I guess, okay, yeah, I guess it is a six-cylinder. But still... It's not like can you actually raise the capacity of a of a gun like that? Uh, like I know Bioshock, you do by adding like a thing on the side of it. Yeah, what I thought that was cool. I liked it. I like I like the way that weapon upgrades work in Bioshock. Yeah, you could actually see them. Yeah, Bioshock Infinite, I don't think even does that. I think it had some rudimentary upgrades. The upgrades in Bioshock Infinite were pointless. Cause they have they had such a polluted weapon pool, and you can only carry two guns at a time. Yeah, and they always drop. Stoop. They always drop weapons that you don't want or need ammo for weapons you don't want or need. Yeah, it followed that stupid trend of carrying two weapons. Why do we? Why do we need? Why did? Why? Why was that necessary? Bioshock One and Two always had like. They do appeal to dude bros. Well, you can appeal to dude bros with a bunch of why is why is limited weapons better? Who is that's like saying oh 720p is better than 1080p? And there are people who actually say that. Well, those people are dum dums. Yeah. Who hells are? Who are you? Me llamo Ramon Salazar. That means I am Ramon Salazar, Ramon Salazar in or my name. Look, those is right hand. Little jaws. I've been expecting you, my brethren. No thanks, bro. Bro. 
There we go. That's I think that's his line from this. I suggest you surrender yourself and simply become our hostage. Or Mr. Scott, you can give us the girl because you're not worth a penny, I'm afraid. Why do you call him Scott? His, I think his middle name is Scott, but Leon Scott Kennedy. Yeah, LSK. That's not relevant. I just said his initials. We'll find a cure. I just imagine that the cutscene I did there. But I'm the one that did it. All right. Okay, All go right. up there. No, 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 no. Go up there. It's on the other side. Yeah. I found that one. My first playthrough, and I was proud of myself. Ashley's a big dum dum here. I want to play Dragon's Dogma. I do too. My PS Plus expense thing expired, so I can't play a Dark Arisen anymore. I played like an hour of it. Not even an hour. Buy more PS Plus. We can play DMC then. Isn't it like five bucks for a month? Uh. I don't know. I mean, the only, I just got it because it came free with the PS4 winning Taco Bell. You got a year of it. Yeah, I got a whole dang year of it, and I felt like that would never end, and then it ended. My brother bought, like, another year after that year ended. Really? Because it was only, like, 60 bucks, and he was like, well, I might as well. I get, I get games from it. And I was like, okay. I, mean, I guess it is free. It's not free. Anybody who says free... I mean, free, free games for... It's not, they're not free games. Well, it's like... There's, there there, would be, like, a full-priced game, and you could say that you're paying for that game, and then you get a bunch of free games after... Because that's the way free, I think. Because you still have to keep paying for it. Well, not if you pay for a year of it and then not pay the next year. Then oh, wait, you yeah, you do need anymore. to do that to play the game. That's right. That's right. Well, I'm going to shoot this next episode on... Uh, hey, can I see that Wii Remote? Guns of Icarus. Can I see that Wii Remote? You son of bitch! <laughs> <laughs>